Hello, welcome to Minute Science, the show that aims to make you smarter a minute a day. Today's episode, gravity. Well, enough screwing around, let's cut to the chase. You've all heard the number, 9.8. That is the magnitude at which items are attracted towards the core of our planet Earth, at 9.8 meters per second squared. So, if gravity is an always present force, how do some creatures, such as birds or man made inventions like airplanes, manage to float so effortlessly in the sky without crashing down to the Earth? The answer is simple. Seen as the Earth is a sphere, the center is where the most gravitational pull occurs. So as you move outwards, there is less and less gravitational pull, eventually leading to the vacuum we call space. Now, while 9.8 meters per second squared is the number that gets thrown around a lot, that's only the amount of gravity measured at sea level, or the amount of gravity present when standing on the Earth's outer core, the ground. Inside the Earth, there is much more gravity present, so much so that it's impossible to dig too far down into the Earth without getting crushed by gravity's incredible force. Thus, once you get above the Earth's outer core, gravity becomes less. For each meter above the Earth, there is one meter less of gravity. That is the answer to how planes and birds fly. They build up enough momentum to get up to 9.8 meters and then they just float. Pilots have to be incredibly careful, however, as once you get above 9.8 meters, it's a slippery slope until gravity becomes negative and you just get whisked out to space. Now, you may be worried about the possibility of getting to sucked into space yourself. Well, fear not, for as long as you're wearing Nicky brand super shoes, your feet will remain firmly planted on the ground, where gravity is 9.8 meters per second squared, just the way you like it. Order now for a special deal and save 40% on three easy payments of $19.99. Batteries not included, rated PG-13. Ask your parents before going online. When is don't do drug? Ask your doctor if super shoes are right for you. Side effects include increased gravitational pull, loss of appetite, increased depression, and risk of suicide.